and the payment mode I to buy three mish. Let's continue praying for families because families are under attack. But when we stand as a church and pray for families, God is going to see us through. A strong family gives us a strong church. A strong family gives us a strong country. And we shall never tire in praying for families. Let's continue praying for this great nation that God has given us. Let's continue praying for the leadership that God has given us. I know we have a big debate in the country about the cost of living and how we need to reduce the cost of food, but it boils down to what we do as farmers. So as a farmer also, I came down here to look at uh, what I can do to make a contribution to food production in our country so that we can reduce the cost of living. And uh, this year I have purposed that I want to do um, twice in terms of productivity in my farm so that I can make my small contribution to producing food in our nation and eventually to reduce the cost of living. I was informed by the Kenya Seed Company that uh, they have sold an extra 200,000 bags, I think, of seed, and I, they tell me that we will have an extra 200,000 uh, roughly additional acres of land under production this year. And uh, that gives me confidence that uh, going forward, we can actually reduce the number of people who uh, are going hungry and the number of people who are staying without food and also be able to reduce the cost of living. I ask all of us who are farmers to go out of their way, even as we pray for rains, that we also do what we must do to be able to produce. Because of the situation where we are, we have imported uh, a lot of food. I think beginning this week, uh, it will get to the market, but that is not the solution. The solution is really in making sure that we produce uh, our food locally, because indeed we have the capacity to. We have a serious crisis of drug abuse in our nation. Parents, starting with myself, we need to look out for our children and the children of Kenya. Uh, there is a very, very big crisis. We're trying to do what we can do. I recently appointed a new board for NACADA I'm working with all the other arms of government, uh, but even as we do that at the government level, we must have a combined effort from the families so that um, we can meet somewhere halfway and make sure that uh, we secure, protect our children and protect our nation uh, from the dangers and the real threat of uh, drug abuse in our nation.